Okay. For context, right? For context, that I. Welcome back to Baird Bros. We're finally playing Kingdom Hearts one again. I I was gone, right? I don't know. I think you actually were here. I don't remember getting to enter the world. But. Well, uh, we also got there like four years ago, five years ago. Oh, well. Yeah, I just I found out place? one of our viewers has and only experienced Kingdom Hearts through ah. our gameplay, so. Is that Cub? This is yeah. a heartless world, so Cub. maybe it'll just disappear. Let me introduce you to one of my favorite franchises. But no but she's watched the series. Let me reintroduce you to one of my favorite franchises. I'm sure we'll find our like, again. this Everyone series goes all the way back to the point no where Christopher was still making <laughs> thumbnails. Yeah, it does. Whoa. Which yeah. means there's like... You're right. really and then it, at, at one point during this style. series, one point during the series, it just stops. <laughs> because he stopped making thumbnails because he got busy with stuff. I, I became a father. I... I, well, I... No. Was I... Did I already have kids when we started this? Yes. Ah, oh, that freaked me yes. out. Yep. I don't know. I think... Six years ago, Alex would have been yeah. one. I became a father again. Economy You've become worse. a father twice more during the course of this channel. Yes. And a cat dad. I have a cat. Yeah. I'm not a lefty yet. Which would you say everyone's wrong? I'm a puppy uncle. Oh! Donald saved you there. We call yeah, if oh. only I knew how to play this game on Xbox. It's we, the same buttons. We tell Haru that I he know. has cat cousins because my sisters in law have cats. So here's the thing. Yeah. Poor Haru doesn't know Haru. Is I only cow. played the beginning of Kingdom Hearts. Really? I think most of this series was Daniel playing. Da we had this on PS2, but End of the World was where the disc was scratched. So yeah, we so we could never finish never it. Finished. We never got to the I final. I watched the ending cutscenes and stuff online. So. Did we ever like even get to the final fight? I don't think so because it would start skipping as we were trying to get across the island to the final fight. It would oh, take me a minute to re-remember about... the controls because I haven't. You see, I replayed through the game so that we could play it on Xbox because I was like, I don't want to set up my PS3 just to play this again. So I'm gonna talk real quick about how stupidly overpowered Donald is, but it never like he doesn't utilize his abilities until Kingdom Hearts 3, and he only does it once. Well, yeah, and he kind of almost dies. He does kind of almost die doing it, but he casts a spell that canonically, in the multiverse that is Final Fantasy, no other being has the ability to cast. Daniel, you want to play? <laughs> because I Zeta Flare play. is canonically four billion times more powerful than Mega Flare. Zeta Flare? Yeah. Yeah. And, like... No other character has ever like they've talked about it, but they've but they're just like nobody's powerful enough to cast Zeta Flare. And Donald does it. But Goofy, before Donald even does it, knows Says what he's doing. No don't! Which implies that he's done it before. Yeah, Donald has killed and will kill again. <laughs> Either he's done it before, and Goofy knows that he's done it before, and he was there and he witnessed whatever it was. Or he knows that Donald's powerful enough to do it and was just worried that this was going to be universe breaking that he would do it. But he knows Donald's powerful enough to do it. Which means Donald is powerful enough that he doesn't have to get his butt kicked this much. Donald could have defeated Sephiroth. Oh, on come his own. on! He could have. <laughs> Donald could have. He could have cast. Because the only other character that is like. Well, I guess there's a couple other characters, but the most notable one is Bahumut. Bahamut? 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 Bahamut. Bahamut. My bad. I said it wrong. Bah Bahamut. The summon? Yeah, the summon. Bahamut is one of the only other beings who is powerful enough to cast uh, Zeta Flare. Not Zeta Flare. Because nobody else has cast Zeta Flare. Zeta, 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 Zeta Flare. Zeta Flare. Yeah, Zeta Flare? I always said it's Zeta Flare. Because down on the other. So. Um. The voice acting right at the, that point of the game was, like, intense. It was. Everybody talks about, like, all the Kingdom Hearts voice acting being really bad, but I don't think it's... Like, there is some really flat voice acting, in some, especially in the first one. Looking at, Le looking at you, Leon! Um, Leon! 
I haven't done that, in that. Time. <laughs> but but I don't I don't know I feel like Kingdom Hearts gets a lot of crap but I'm also a dedicated fan I'm not gonna tell you how much I spent on three figures but I won't even be here until September seven billion I, I will tell you it's less than that are we gonna get roasted in the comments again for this being too hard? I I don't know. Maybe we are. If you would like to roast us in the comments, please don't. I'm sad. What is this? I'm very sensitive. I will have a good cry. Call me because they I called Daniel and I bad at the game. Yep. Look, they're welcome to call me bad at the game. I don't know how to play. But he will Bruce fist fight you if you tell Daniel, say Daniel's bad at the game. Yeah. He, he's a pacifist. He's a pacifist right through you for knocking on his brother. I, I, just, I am a pacifist most of the time. But I've gotten into a couple of fights. What? I know. Uh -huh. <laughs> Noah says no. -uh. I know. Both of them were with me. <laughs> the guy who punched me in the face the other day said he's a pacifist. An accident. <laughs> William okay, and I, so William I had, had a some rough teenage years together. And Bruce won each time. Yeah, but Christopher doesn't I mean, mess with me as much nowadays, so yeah. I mean, I'm also a lot more chilled than I was a decade ago. Yeah. Heck, a decade ago, I was more chilled than I was 15 years ago. You yeah, mellowed out a lot, especially once you had kids. I mean, I just got to a point where I was done being angry all the time and done being negative and pessimistic and just a complete a-hole. You mean you Man. grew up? Yeah. I got tired. Golly, I wish some other people your age would do that. I mean, I still have a decent amount of aggression in me, but most of it's towards, like, the economic powers that be. It's, it's, the, it's the man. It's the man. Steve. That's, that's my one, that's the one drawback, really. Like, the one thing that I really don't like about applying for, like, general manager positions is I feel like I'm becoming the man. And it feels wrong. Like, I'm doing it out of necessity because, like, I need money. I gotta take care of my family. But, dude. Oh, wait. Oh. Get underneath it and whack him in. Climb up on the Hydra's back! <laughs> Climb up on the Hydra's back! Climb up on the Hydra's back! Come on! Take that! I need to rewatch it. I've been considering watching the 63 episodes of the animated series. Uh, it's terrible and cheesy. I'm specifically thinking about watching the Aladdin crossover episode. There was an Aladdin crossover episode? There was. There's also an episode where Meg shows up. I remember the Meg episode, but like the Aladdin episode. And it's, it's not just Aladdin. It's Aladdin 3 Aladdin. Oh! So he shows up wearing his outfit from Aladdin 3. I, I okay. like Aladdin 3. The Aladdin sequels were good. Oh my gosh. The second I, one please. wasn't as good as the third one, though, I feel like. No, the third one was awesome. The third one was great. The second one was just, it was just rehashing Jafar. Yeah, I didn't know that there were a second one. The second one rehashes Jafar. The third one is uh, Aladdin's dad is the... Uh, the king of thieves. king of thieves. The 40 thieves. Yeah, the king of the 40 thieves. That's what I was trying yeah, to say. Yeah, more stuff from the book that inspired Aladdin. Yeah. It's actually, it's fun. And they got Robin Williams to come back in the third one. He didn't come back in the second one. What, didn't they for the second one just take his dialogue that he had recorded and no, retool it? they had an impressionist come in. Into it. Okay. I think it was the same guy actually that played uh, Mushu in the second Mulan. Wait, Eddie Murphy didn't do... Uh -uh. Maybe it was a different guy, but it, I know that it, Eddie Murphy was not in the second one. There was a second one. There was, and that one's actually... Straight to video. That one's okay. Did you know that there's like four Cinderella movies? And uh, three Little Mermaids? I, 
I didn't know there was a third one. Though. Yeah, the third one is Ariel's beginning. It's, it's a, a prequel. prequel. The third one's a prequel. Ariel's mom is still alive in it. But not for the entire movie. Obviously. Oh, are you going this back to weird. save? Oh, that's the beginning? Yeah, yeah. you follow the way I get there. I've... I get turned around here just because uh, it's, it's islands and there's not space. walls. Kingdom Hearts has a couple of these levels where it's just big empty space. Oh, getting squished again. Yeah, the end of the game here is just kind of a gauntlet. Yeah. Which is also a fun game that we should play. Oh, but no, did you know there's a Little Mermaid TV series? And a Latin TV series, too? And a Hercules. And a Hercules. Well, we talked about the Hercules one, like, five minutes ago. Yeah. And a, um, Emperor's New School. Yep, the Emperor's New School. I love that. At least that one took everything and was just like, okay, we're just gonna use these characters. It has absolutely nothing to do with the movie. No, no, no! The Emperor also, has to go to school. Oh, that's what it was. He goes back to school or whatever. Because it's after Kronk's new group. Yes, but like, Yzma's the principal. Yeah. How's that make sense? Yzma's in disguise as Yzma. Oh, but in the Aladdin... <laughs> <laughs> in, in the Aladdin Hercules crossover episode, Daniel, Jafar goes to talk to Hades and make a deal. Mike, I... Okay. The fact that Aladdin yeah. beats the crap out of Hercules. Well, Herc's, Herc's only weakness is gonna be magic. Well, and a young Hercules, too. Yeah, the, 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 the timeline of the Hercules TV show is weird. Well, because you know, there's like randomly an episode where he's older and he's packing things up, and then has a flashback and it goes back to young Hercules. That's weird. Yeah. Because it, ha it happens in the middle of the movie? Yeah. It's the, um, the... Basically. The thing. Uh, it's... I don't know what it's supposed to be based. But it makes after reference... One. It makes references to the second one. I think, I think it's after Kronk's new group. Okay. But then also yeah. they forget about things that happened in the first one. Uh-huh. And, um... Who's go lives in whose house? Watches. Oh, oh, right. Yeah. I didn't ever really watch it. That that one was out when I was a teenager. I got a majority of the way through the show because I enjoyed it. I thought it was fun. The when they put out the Kingdom Hearts series, it either needs to be like the best anime style they can get. Or it needs to feel like a 90s Disney animated series adaptation of a movie. What if, and hear me out here, it just doesn't involve Sora? It's just a separate if, Kingdom Hearts no, universe. Dude, Unchained Key. I could see that, yeah. That would be so cool. Yeah, I could see... I... Then they could come up with an original character to follow. And incorporate everything else in. Yeah, that's it's a good point. An you, yeah. and and it would be a good way for everybody that didn't play. You gotta go to that island with the chest over. Union there. Cross, I and know. Unchained Key, and all that stuff. <coughs> it, it'd be a good way for them to experience the series or the, experience the story. Daniel, the islands are arrows. But I was following the arrow, and it didn't do yeah, it didn't anything. Him, oh, you go straight to the other one. But yeah, Kingdom Hearts series, if it happens. I mean, it's been rumored basically since Disney Plus became a thing, but also it's... Disney's working out. It's been rumored for a very long like time, actually. Like they're supposed to be either buying an anime studio or starting their own. Because they've got their Twisted Wonderland series. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, and it, it wouldn't be the first anime that they've done, or the first anime that they've gotten rights to to put on Disney Plus. It's just usually those are in Japan. I... 
uh, you know who owns the rights to publish uh, the new Bleach anime? Disney? Disney, yeah. So, yeah, right in the right, US, right, it's right, on Hulu. Yeah, on Hulu. Which, but in Japan, it's on Disney Plus. Disney might not own Hulu for that much longer. Um, no, they've been working on making some deals and things. Yeah, Hulu might end up just getting owned by Fox again. Yeah. Which, Doesn't I mean, Disney owns Disney Fox. Owns okay. They, they own everything Fox except the news stations. Mm -hmm. Oh, did you guys hear that uh, Disney officially has the distribution rights back for the Hulk movies, so they're gonna... Oh, do that! Yeah. Yeah, the, the, the deal finally ended. Yep, they, they finally got the distribution rights. Which means the they can actually they can make the Hulk work. movie They're gonna do their wanting to. World War Hulk movie now. Which, I mean, they'll have to adapt carefully, because there's a lot of that story that they've done, but there's also a lot they haven't. This is it! And it's not like they can just break off the entire eastern seaboard in okay. the MCU. Sure they can. Well, they, that didn't actually happen in the comics. He just shook the eastern That's seaboard. Right. Which would be... Because he jumped from space. No. I thought that's what it was. No. Really? No, he was standing on the earth, and it was just so mad that he stomped the ground. Oh, that's what it was. And caused an earthquake. Ooh. I thought there was a point that he, like, jumped from space and broke off a big chunk of the United States. I don't think so. Maybe. Maybe when he was fighting Sentry. Maybe. Oh, they... I don't think they've introduced Sentry. Nope. They haven't. But, um, I heard Guardians of the Galaxy might introduce Wonder Man? I, I'm not sure. I know it has Adam Warlock. It has Nathan Fillion in it. And I know Nathan Fillion was one of the guys they were considering to play Wonder Man. But I haven't seen Guardians 3. I would love to see it when it comes on Disney+. Plus. It has the first F word in the MCU. It does. It does. Uh, Crispy Ratman said it. Yeah. I don't, I don't like this Ratman. I like the Crispy Ratman. You're allowed to like Crispy Ratman. I like Tom Holland and you don't like Tom Holland. And that's I, well, you're wrong for that. So. Well, you're wrong for liking Chris <laughs> Pratt. So. It's okay to be wrong. He's my new least favorite Mario. I, he did a really good job. <laughs> Okay. He did, uh, I, I haven't heard of Mario I didn't like. And that includes the Mario that sounds like this. He was the best Mario. Hey, Luigi. <laughs> I think Danny DeVito would have done the best job. <laughs> yeah, but I think they should get him for Wario for sure. Yeah. Wario, okay, the two actors I look at. Danny DeVito or uh, Morgan Freeman. <laughs> Morgan Freeman is Wario. Yes, I, Wario. It's a me. Wario. His name. I can't think of the Green Goblin. Oh, oh yeah. He should be Waluigi. He would do a good job. Yes. Waluigi. Yes. Uh, Willem Dafoe. Willem Dafoe. Oh, Dafoe. Yeah. Dude, I saw an interview with him on Jimmy Fallon where he was talking about like people Did wanting him to play the Joker. Did and he, he, he said no. He that. Okay. Sorry. You're good. The can I finish real quick? Yeah. yeah. So, like, he was talking to Jimmy Fallon, and Jimmy Fallon's like, there's a lot of people who want you to put the Joker in. I actually went to DC, and I pitched the thing to him that they weren't really on board for, but I wanted to play an imposter of the Joker. He's like, I wanted to play this guy who's like, yeah, I'm, I'm the new Joker, but it, DC didn't really want to go for that, and, like, you know, have the Joker go after him and stuff. But it's, it's what it's it is. It's something that could have worked, though. That would have been There really is canonically fun. three Jokers in the comics. Yeah. There were... Before the universe got rebooted again. Yeah. Again? Yeah. Yeah, but the DCEU is becoming the DCU. They're going to need a new Joker unless they're just going to go with Walking Phoenix. Or not Walking Phoenix, pardon me. Uh, no, Walking walk right. I was, I was thinking yeah. River Phoenix. Walk, River Phoenix was his brother that died in the 90s. Um, what about uh, yeah. Morbius Man? So, just going back to Jared, uh, Willem Leto. Jared Leto. I can't remember anybody's names right Willem now. Willem Dafoe and oh Tobey Maguire mm -hmm. hold uh, jointly hold the record of having their characters having played the same characters the longest. Yeah. In, in, in superhero movies. Yeah, in superhero movies. A record which was previously held 
by Hugh Jackman, Hugh Jackman. Oh. and Patrick Stewart in uh, Logan. Right. Well, and they'll, then they'll they'll get that back when they show up in Deadpool. Yeah, actually. And then Tobey Maguire will show up again. So I haven't watched the Flash. And it'll just be traded between the four of them. Do any of you guys care about Flash spoilers? Nope. I don't. No, okay. I'm, I'm not, not likely watch. to if, watch if it. If anybody watching this video is sensitive towards the Flash spoilers, then what's wrong with you? Then stop watching. <laughs> <laughs> Cover your ears for a minute. It has a lot of cameos, but most of them are CG. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. With, like, I don't know if it has impressionists or, like, AI re uh, reconstructions of their voices. But, yeah, they've got, like, Adam West has a speaking part and Christopher Reeves has a speaking part. And, but, but, the one thing, the one cameo that's going to make me, like, I mean, I'm watching this movie for Michael Keaton and Nicolas Cage. Yep. Because Nicolas Cage gets to be Superman. What? Yeah. That is a reference to him almost playing Superman. Did you know he was going to be Superman Actually, in the, 90s? the second time he's played Superman. Oh, that's true. It's his second time he's played Superman. Because he, he also played Superman But this will be his first live action appearance. Teen oh, Titans oh. Go versus the Justice League. Yeah, no. Uh, oh, are you ending the episode? Yes. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> but, but Noah, he, Tim Burton, who because direct, he directed two Batman movies, was going to do a Superman movie. Mm -hmm. And Nicolas Cage was his Superman. He, they had the suit for it and everything. They had there the are plot. pictures of him there are wearing the suit. Videos of him wearing... Have you seen the test for the flute that has all the lights in it? Yeah, there was a suit they were going to have him wear that had all these lights running through it, too. Oh, that's cool. It was dope, and we never got to see that movie. Well, anyway, thank, thank you, you guys watching. so much for watching Bear Bros. Don't like the comments down below. They're made of cardboard. Ring the, <laughs> ring the doorbell and the subscribe button. <laughs> Share this to everyone you know love and hate so we can annoy them for you. And make sure the word gets spread that Donald is just holding back the entire time. And we need to stop it. <laughs> Goodbye, This bye. is the beginning of my campaign to get Nomura to let Donald just let <laughs> loose on somebody. <laughs> Goodbye, well, bye. For an entire uh, Kingdom Hearts game. I'm trying to end, Chris. Goodbye, bye. Come on, man. Bye. 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 Bye.